So the cybersecurity networks in Australia and the UK are trying to help organisations prevent unauthorised access and unintended consequences. Um, and we do that by stepping back and helping them uh, take a, a holistic view of their organisation. Cyber attackers are, are strategic. Uh, some of them, uh, as we can see from the heightened threat levels at the moment, uh, some of them are, are really quite well educated and well informed. And so strategically, what does it mean to a business? Businesses from a security standpoint, a cyber security standpoint, but holistically a security standpoint, need to understand the context of their organisation. They need to understand what the vulnerabilities are in the context of their organisation um, and uh, look at the best ways to protect it in, in, in that context, in a, in a bigger picture context. So we help uh, do that with organisations top down, so strategically from board, director, business owner, entrepreneur level, uh, and then bring in the right resources at the right time throughout the organisation. But from a network uh, operator's perspective, again, like any business, they need to step back, have a look at it holistically, not just protect in one place, but protect throughout uh, the network, but in the context of what the organisation needs. Data needs to be treated like it would uh, we would any other belonging. I think the other thing we have to understand with attackers, so there are the five or five primary attacker types and there are three main vectors for, for, how, they, uh, for how they attack. And this probably isn't new to anyone uh, technical or, or it, it may be, but it, it is well publicised out there that you know, we've got terrorists and we know that that's now heightened. Uh, we have uh, criminals um, and we have script kiddies <laughs> and things like that. And it's a matter of well, what are they after? What is their strategy? So the organisation really has to understand what is their ecosystem. Not Their perimeter isn't their perimeter anymore. Their perimeter is their ecosystem and users make them vulnerable no matter what traditional security they put in place. So it really needs to get out to directors of organisations of any size to contextualise. And it needs to get out to end users.